This is Banjul, an island city that stood the test of time, served as an economic hub in the colonial days and still harbors a huge chunk of the economic and administrative activities of the country. Banjul House is the seat of power, the state house of the Gambia. For decades, the city has been neglected and gradually losing its glory as the capital city of the Gambia. To revive the city to its lost glory, His Excellency President Adama Barrow, with support from partners, took it as a priority to rehabilitate the city to the modernity it deserves. President Barrow's agenda for the city is to transform it into an envy of the sub-region. Consequently, a couple of months ago, he embarked on an unannounced tour of the city to get first-hand information about the current situation of the drainage and sewage system. The city of Banjul, a side of its former self when rehabilitated, will boost the economic activities of the city, revive its cultural heritage and present it with a new outlook that is befitting of a city. We are visiting another capital city. They are clean, the roads are paved. I see no reason why we cannot do it. I think Gambia is lacking behind. But lack of maintenance also is a big problem. For well, these roads we have done in 1989, 1989-1990. They did all this road, phase one, phase two, phase three. But because there was no maintenance. Yes. But it all goes with maintenance. Because we have to Jamono Jawara, Tigala economic wise, the new one is in terms of living. New age affair infrastructure. We would have a lagging on top, 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 top. So to Banjo Ina. This project will alleviate the social standard of Banjo. The people of Banjo are very appreciative towards this initiative simply because uh, it's a fact I wouldn't even tell you. You know that uh, Banjul is in, as I always said, in the emergency room, meaning that uh, it is yelling for help. We all have seen the situation of Banjul, how Banjul is the deplorable the way it is, and um, people have been, been crying to see Banjul face lifted. And there we go now, with the help of the, the central government, headed by His Excellency the President, Mr. Adam Abaro. The rehabilitation of Banjul could not have come at a better time than the period marking the 54th independence anniversary of the Gambia. Join His Excellency President Adam Abaro for the launching of the Banjul Rehabilitation Project on Saturday, 16 February 2019.